When we think about sweeteners, the first things that usually come to mind are sugar and its artificial substitutes. But in recent years, more and more people are turning to natural alternatives to satisfy their sweet tooth without the added calories or health risks. One of the most talked about natural sweeteners is stevia. You may have seen it in the form of little green packets at coffee shops or listed as an ingredient in sugar-free beverages and snacks. But what exactly is stevia? Where does it come from? And why is it becoming such a popular choice among health-conscious individuals? Let's take a deep dive into the world of stevia, a natural sweetener derived from the leaves of the stevia plant right here on History of Simple Things. Stevia, scientifically known as Stevia rabaudiana, is a plant native to South America, particularly Paraguay and Brazil. Indigenous communities in these regions have used the leaves of this plant for centuries, both as a sweetener and for medicinal purposes. The Guarani people referred to it as kahe, meaning sweet herb, and used it to sweeten their traditional yerba mate tea and other beverages. The leaves were also chewed for their sweet taste or used to treat conditions like burns, stomach discomfort, and colic. Despite being thousands of times sweeter than regular sugar, stevia leaves contain zero calories, making it an attractive option in the world of natural health and nutrition. So how does this leafy green plant transform into the white crystalline powder or clear liquid you might find in your pantry today? The process involves extracting the sweet compounds from the leaves, particularly stevial glycosides, which are the components responsible for stevia's sweetness. These glycosides, especially rabaudioside A and steviaside, are carefully separated and purified through water extraction and filtering processes. The result is a highly concentrated sweetener that is about 50 to 300 times sweeter than sucrose or table sugar. And the best part? It doesn't spike blood sugar levels, making it especially appealing for people with diabetes or those looking to manage their carbohydrate intake. One of the biggest reasons for stevia's rise in popularity is its potential as a sugar substitute without the drawbacks associated with artificial sweeteners. While sweeteners like aspartame, saccharin, and sucralose have faced criticism and health concerns over the years, stevia stands out because it's derived from a natural source. The World Health Organization has deemed stevia safe for consumption, and in 2008, the U.S. Food and Drug Administration granted generally recognized as safe status to high-purity stevial glycosides. That opened the door for companies to begin, including it in a wide range of products, from diet sodas and yogurts to protein bars and even toothpaste. But of course, like any food product, stevia has its own quirks. One of the most commonly noted characteristics is its aftertaste. Some people find that stevia leaves a slightly bitter or licorice-like flavor after consumption, particularly when used in large amounts or in less refined forms. However, newer stevia extracts like Rabaudioside M and Rabaudioside D have helped reduce this bitterness and improve the overall taste. Food scientists and manufacturers are continually working to create better blends and formulations to match the flavor profile of sugar as closely as possible without the calories or the crash. Another interesting aspect of stevia is how it interacts with our body. Unlike sugar, which is metabolized and contributes to calorie intake, Stevia's glycosides pass through the body largely undigested. Our gut microbiota helps break them down into stevial, which is then absorbed and excreted via urine. Because of this process, 
Stevia has no significant impact on blood glucose or insulin levels. Several studies have even suggested that stevia may have beneficial effects, including potential antihypertensive, anti-inflammatory, and antioxidant properties. While more research is needed to confirm these benefits, the early findings are promising and point towards stevia being more than just a sweet treat. If you're considering using stevia in your own kitchen, there are a few things to keep in mind. First, because stevia is much sweeter than sugar, a little goes a long way. Many stevia products come with measurement guidelines, such as one teaspoon equals one cup of sugar equivalents. It's available in multiple forms, powders, liquid drops, baking blends, and even fresh or dried leaves. While pure stevia extract is extremely potent, it's often mixed with bulking agents like erythritol or dextrose to make it easier to use in everyday cooking. These combinations are ideal for baking, where you want to mimic the texture and volume that sugar typically provides. From a sustainability perspective, stevia is also considered environmentally friendly. Compared to sugarcane or corn used in high fructose syrups, stevia requires significantly less land, water, and resources to produce. This efficiency is another reason why large food and beverage companies are investing heavily in stevia as part of their commitment to sustainability and healthier consumer options. As global demand for low-calorie, plant-based sweeteners grows, Stevia's role in agriculture and food production is expected to expand even more in the coming years. So, is Stevia right for you? If you're trying to reduce your sugar intake, manage your weight, or simply want to make healthier choices without sacrificing sweetness, Stevia can be a great alternative. It's plant-based, zero-calorie, and suitable for people with diabetes. However, like with all foods, moderation and personal taste preference play an important role. Some people might love its clean, sweet flavor, while others may need time to adjust or prefer blended versions that mask any aftertaste. Still, it's safe to say that Stevia has carved out its place in the modern world of nutrition, bridging the gap between natural tradition and scientific innovation. Stevia isn't just a trendy ingredient, it's a fascinating natural sweetener with deep cultural roots and growing scientific backing. From its humble origins in the rainforests of South America to supermarket shelves around the globe, Stevia has proven that nature can offer delicious, health-conscious alternatives to sugar. Whether you're sipping on a Stevia sweetened iced tea or experimenting with sugar-free baking, this tiny green leaf continues to make a big impact on how we enjoy sweetness today. Thank you for watching. If you have suggestions for our next video, feel free to share them in the comments below. We'll be sure to give you an acknowledgement for your contribution. Thank you for joining us on this journey through the history of simple things. Don't forget to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more stories woven through the smallest details.